Hey CJ, welcome back to Mountain Blade. So in the last episode we got two quests and we're gonna start one of them right now. Back the bandits. We have reinforcements, ton of farmers. And they have a ton of bandits. Let's see the scores. Uh I have 36 allies. And by 36 I mean 36 of my uh, al and by allies I mean 36 of uh my army. 25 allies, which are the farmers. And now there's only 28 enemies left. Uh, the frames don't seem that bad, so I'll try to get involved. Just so many units, though. I wonder if my computer will be able to handle the other games. Uh, better. Specifically the bigger battles. I hope they, like, optimize it later. We'll find out. Eventually. Nice. No, I don't want to treat. There we go. Yeah, we're going to take it. Out of curiosity, do you happen to have a training quest? Because I think, like, they seem more likely to have a training quest if they were... I have issues, bandits. At least from what I've seen. Problem is, if we stay to train them, then we might not uh, succeed in the other quest. Okay, nope, cattle. Never mind. Don't have to worry about that. Alright, back the way we came. Because in the last episode, we discovered we went... I think it was from Yalin... We need to make a delivery from Yellen to um, Togola, which I thought was this town, but it's not. It's actually this town. So I have to... And that's where I started the previous episode, too, so that was not great. Uh, Rolf leveled up. Rolf is a pretty nice guy, I think, so we're going to go ahead and upgrade him. Where is he? Where is he at? There he is. Let's talk about your skills. I guess so far it seems like his wages are related to his level. Like upgrade his agility. He has high intelligence. It's like his high stat. Wow. I usually think of my men more as soldiers than as a. Uh, well, anything other than that. I don't know what that would, kind of stats would involve. A uh, well, I think he said he was a noble. So that could explain his higher intelligence. But it's supposed to be like from a distant land. Okay. Yeah, we're not going to bother with most village quests. Because it turns out they don't give you much renown or um, money. We did grain in the last episode. We got nothing from it other than positive relation to the village. So unless we can attack... So okay, they're going to take that castle. Nice. That castle we failed to capture several times. Good for them. Alright. Um, best route. It's the same either way. Just go straight there. We have a pretty mixed party, too, so that's not good. We got so many different units. We got this Manhunter. I don't even know what this upgrades into. It's supposed to be like a Bounty Hunter, I think. Alright, I don't want to upgrade you because mercenaries are expensive. Okay, let's go to that city and see if there's a tournament. It'd be fairly convenient if there's a tournament at the uh, town I'm going to. Alright. 
Alright. Oh, we can't see if there's a torment. Because the arena is going to be locked. Gah. Did I have anything to sell? Yes, I did. Gotta be careful not to sell the wine. All right, how's the money situation? 30,000. Not the greatest. But we'll have to make do. I don't think I pay that much in wages anyway, right? Maybe P for party. Yeah, almost a thousand. If you add R after the first letter, it's trash. It's a trash town. All right, anyway, enough trying to diss their towns with lame disses. Oh, what do you got here? Deserter, seven. Oh, not going to catch them. Yeah, this is an area where we can't fight bandits. Because they always run away. Okay, wages. <laughs> There's a big war party. Okay, that's weird. Um, anyway. Let's complete this quest. Unless this is the wrong town. In which case, I'll be really disappointed. Okay, I got money for that. Yeah, click on the town. There we go. Arena. Tournaments, please. Okay, we passed that town. It's literally like the one I wanted to check, too. More back and forth. At least this time it's not on the other side of the map. That would have been annoying. Hi. So glad I'm out against you guys. Jeez. Are these assemble in, like, the enemy territory? Like, not in your territory? Just saying. Are you guys even at war with anyone? Be hilarious that they weren't. Uh, yeah, but not anyone you're near. I guess they're kind of near them. Actually, they're borderline both. It's the same. Declare one of the Swandons, then just take the city. Like that's the only way they could take it. Okay, I think someone didn't like him. All right. Or maybe I think of someone else. No, it's this guy. Oh. Well. That also might be affecting morale, actually. Tournament. Uh, place a bet on myself, sure. It's only 100. Okay, I got a sword, so this should be okay. Well, it would help if... Everyone followed me. Fortunately, that doesn't make the enemies follow me. That's a lot of yellow teammates. Okay, I'm green. No swords. Or no uh, bows. So that's like the only thing that I'm not too great at. It's, and it's usually when... Um, I'm stuck with swords and the other team isn't. Because if they're not stuck with. If they are stuck with bows. If everyone's stuck with bows, then it's fine. That's actually perfect. But if um, I'm stuck with the bow and someone's stuck with the sword, I'm probably going to lose because I'm at a disadvantage. Yes. Come to my men. My army. I don't know how many are left. Looks like three. Yeah, that guy decided he wanted to go ahead. Good job. Champion fighter. 
Hired Blade, and Veteran Fighter. Alright, I'm feeling pretty good about this tournament. As long as everyone follows me. Nice. Drancid, too. Probably got him because I'm so good at two-handed. I thought I got him. I say I'm good at two-handed, and then it's taking like a million hits to take that guy down. Just a regular mercenary swordsman, too. Alright, no horse for you. Two blue men over here. Got him. I wonder if you get experience for taking out the horses. I don't know. Alright, red versus blue. I'll poke you. Got him. So we got a blue guy left. And I think we win now. Okay, everyone follow me. Unless you just want people to stick by me. Cover me. Ouch. Guy didn't take up that much health. Alright, so far we're winning. But I think I could still be eliminated, so I have to be careful. Come on. Need more time to swing. Alright, got that guy. Everyone just charge him. Don't bother following me now. Just swarm him. Hopefully I get down from his horse too. Sometimes they do that. Woke him from behind. Alright, well, he just glitched through that wall. Alright, someone got him. Good work. So the hired blades are uh, people you can hire, or mercenaries you can hire. Okay, let's not go near that fight. Let them damage each other. That guy's on to me. They're all on to me. I'm red. Alright. Be nice if it was a consistent color, too. Like if I stayed red throughout the entire tournament. It's be nice if they had, like, these free for alls instead of just the um, team battles. I guess that helps you stay in longer, but. I think it'd be more interesting if it was a free-for-all and everyone's mod in. Alright, last guy? No. Uh, we're on the same team. Alright, 2v2. Okay, that was an epic fail. I have no idea what's going on. Gotta make sure my guy doesn't get knocked out, though. Because that'll be a 2 on 1. Of course, right now it might be a 2 on 1. Ouch. Bad. Okay, you're just gonna keep hitting me at that, aren't you? Got him. Okay, um. <coughs> oh, rip. Champion Fire 2. So this entire round is champion fighters and myself. Nope, no horse for you. And you're one-handed. So that means you have to get close. Could help if I didn't miss. <coughs> Could just run him over the horse. Unless he stops me. Fortunately, he didn't charge me. 
Okay, sir, this tournament's going on too long. It's gonna keep going on too long. Got him. Let's see if I pick up that uh, two-handed sword. Spot round, yes. All right, champion fighter. One hit, nice. Ah, oh, I didn't get too much money. Oh well. Probably because I'm too good at the tournaments now. Ah, uh, farmer. Okay, perfect. Another quest. Uh, can't pronounce that. Can't pronounce like any of the sounds. Very disappointed. Other than Jake. I feel like I might offend someone if I try to pronounce them too. Obviously not the people in the game, because they don't care. But, like, if these are named after real places... Oh, leveled up. Nice. Okay, we're going into the abyss. Oh, we lost a farmer. Okay, yeah. Just going straight into the abyss. I wonder if there's an edge to this map. Yeah, there has to be, because there's no way they'd let it go on indefinitely. And it appears we found it. Okay, there's a battle going on right here, people. Come on. Never mind. Oof. Textures change. Really should have just had the battle lines a lot shorter. No reason to be out here. Oh, we won. Okay. Well, guess we're gonna take it as we just do. I need the money. We'll see if I can um, train these peasants. Oh, you're good now. All right. That's not what he said, but, uh... Okay. Oh, man. It's because she doesn't like Broca? Alright, well, someone else was complaining about Broca, so we should uh, get rid of him then. Because she was our. Wait, no, she was our spotter, though. Great. We needed her. Unless she just doesn't like the uh, choice units. That's the first time I ever had that. And that's the point of persuasion. Okay, well. And we had, she had a horse, too, darn it. At least she wasn't the one with the armor. Darn it. Wow, I was not expecting that. I'm, like, really angry now. We're upset. We're gonna take it out on these bandits. Oh, I can level up too. I forgot about that. Uh, let's take care of that now then. Um, put a point into intelligence. My persuasion is one. I'm going to up that just in case we try to lose someone else. Oh, that's me. My spotting's pretty high too. No, my spotting's terrible. Um, inventory management. I 
I guess I should probably invest into that. My tracking is terrible too. All right. Um, now let's just go with tactics now. Let's look at the party real quick. Yeah, Broca is now our spotter and tracker. Which honestly, most of the stats are with me. We got trade, pathfinding, tactics. He's got our surgery and uh, wound treatment. It's weird though. Um, can I see their disposition? Yeah, it's like a Broca. That's not what we wanted. Yeah, his morale's low too. Interesting. Even though morale's high. Alright, so here's the plan. He seems like he's also going to desert us. So, we're just going to take his stuff. And we need to separate for a while. Happy about your style of leadership. And not at all happy at the general state of affairs. Okay. Alright, so we just lost two companions in this episode. Yeah, he's enthusiastic. That's good. Yeah, let's check a look at everyone else. Um, okay, he's enthusiastic. I never had this problem before, so... Okay, he's enthusiastic. So he's probably likely to desert, too. She's alright. Alright, um... He's all right. Well, should be all right, right? Yeah. But this guy, I think. Yeah, he's miserable. Um. So we're also got this miss him. <laughs> this is how you. Trust companions. Happy about his share leadership and downright public general state affairs. Okay, so he likes my leadership. Hey, we just lost three companions in this episode. Nice. Oh, that's terrible. But I didn't know uh, who would conflict with who. So last season I picked people that wouldn't conflict, and so that helps. And I didn't really pick anyone's side. But everyone else I think is happy. Right? Yeah, he's enthusiastic. All right. So everyone else should be fine. We have no spotting and tracking now. That's a huge uh, decrease in companions. But we'll sell their stuff. <laughs> That's terrible as that sounds. I hope they didn't have horses. Okay, so that's uh, good to know. They can desert you at any time. Just gotta watch out their uh, morale. Sell that, sell that, sell the boots. Do you have the best equipment anyway? I mean, I said they respawned with better equipment too. Ah, uh, goods. I think it's not food we need to sell. I got a lot of money. All right, so let's get some food then. We'll set a cheese. Just get all the food. Just can actually afford it. All right, and that <laughs> everything's so spread out. That's fine. Nice. Uh, a tavern. Looking for another farmer. Nope. Uh, arena. Another tournament. Nope. Uh, streets for a quest. Oh, the guildmaster far away. Forget that. Let's go in the castle. Castle guard. Interesting. Uh, do you happen to have a quest? Uh, you have any tasks? No, you want mercenaries.
Okay. Fortunately, they don't like it, or they don't care when I decline it that way, so that's fine. All right. Yeah, so the three companions, uh, uh, at least two of the ones I knew wouldn't uh, like me, are gone. I don't know if the other one was all right. I could have kept her around, but too late now. And some of the ones need horses, so we'll have to look out for more. I kind of just give them the stuff we get. All right, uh... Jel... Jokala. So I'm going to choose to pronounce that. Market, no. Um, tavern. Farmer, perfect, another quest. Just having a lot of villages lately. This one. I was looking at the message before it faded away. I don't know if our party site uh, speed changed at all. Manhunter, not gonna bother upgrading. You can upgrade though. Level six. High intelligence again. Let's give you some strength. You work on replacing his armor. All right, no renown for this battle though, unless we get it from completing the quest. All right, someone just went in the river, sir. Sir, um, it's a magic horse. He got down. That horse is literally standing on one foot. Let's retreat. I don't like this town. I'm leaving. I can jump, right? No, not while I'm swimming. Or maybe I think I'm scared. Okay, there's a bandit in the water. So this was a great tactical choice. He's trying to flee the battle. Get back here. Okay, well, that was a little bit of an issue. This epic battle going on here in the water. Got him. There's another one, too. Took out that farmer. He's unconscious. Underwater. He's not going to survive that. Alright, um... Those are more farmers than there are in the village. Like, where they all come from. There we go. They're all men. But I guess that makes more sense. Alright, take us or just you. Got some butter. Nice. Alright, and that'll be the end of the episode. Unfortunately, we lost some companions, which, um, at least two of them, we took away their good stuff, so, or their, anything they had a value on them. The other one may have had a horse, which is pretty valuable. Um, I don't know if we could get her back. Um, if she'd stay permanently, we'll see. Or if she's gone forever. If you like this episode, stay tuned for the next one. I'm TJ, and I'll see you next time.